गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू नाउ वी कैन स्टार्ट आवर चैप्टर नंबर फोर रिमेनिंग वर्क आर यू रेडी ओपन योर बुक एंड सी वेर वी आर डिस्कसिंग नाउ वट इज द चैप्टर नेम वर्ड्स डिड यू ओपन ओपन एंड स्टार्ट नाउ here you can see the picture of the head region of the birds are given in this you can see the type of the beaks first one in the top the picture of a sparrow is given and written beak type what is the type of the beak found in a sparrow here it is written sharp hard and horny and these type of the beak used for eating grains and seeds second one eagle eagle type of the beak is strong sharp and hooked use of the beak by eagle is tearing flesh that's why it is sharp and very strong with a hook like help to tear the flesh of its prey third one woodpecker its beak type very strong hard and chisel shaped chisel is the tool by which we are basically carpenter using this tool to make the hole in the wood this beak used by the woodpecker to make the hole in the bark of tree and digging out the insects got it come to the next part of this next parrot its beak is sharp hard and hooked used for eating grains and seeds next sawalo its beak is short and broad it is used for trapping the insects while flying next one humming bird you know one famous thing about the hummingbird the smallest bird now its beak is long thin and slender used for sucking the nectar from the flowers next duck beak of the duck is broad and flat used digging the mud water mud under water and to filter muddy water to catch the insects okay come to the next topic of this section here in this section you can see like the beaks birds have different kinds of the feet and claws that help them to hold on to branches scratch the grounds catches and uh, catch and hold their prey and wade through water first one is toe for climbing bird like parrot two toes pointing upward and two toes pointing downwards for it is good for uh, this type of the feet are good for sailing to the trees sailing means hanging or catching the branches of tree next one toes of praying bird eagle this type of the toes are very strong sharp and curved claw these type of the uh, claws used for catching the or holding their prey very strongly third one toes for a scratching bird it is called hen means this type of the toes found in hen three legs long toes in front and short toe at back each toe has a sharp horny claw these feet or legs are good for scratching the ground for seeds and worms you saw the hen in our country basically they are scratching the ground and eating next one here thin long legs with wide spreading toes means toes of a wedding bird example of wedding bird crane 
such type of the legs are helping the bird for wading through muddy water without getting wet for a long time in search of prey next one toes for swimming bird like duck its legs are webbed and good for swimming easily in the water next one toes of a perching bird that is called a sparrow means which type of the toes found in a sparrow perching type which type of the toes are found in the duck swimming type you have to write like this or remember like this so next uh, toes of a perching bird means a sparrow toes of a sparrow are slender claw with three toes in front and one toes at the back these are fit or good for gripping the branch of the trees strongly okay today's for today uh, for today's up to here and uh, no written work is there so just you read one more time in your book okay thank you have a nice day